Earthquakes can damage pipes. Leaking gas is dangerous. All types of bad things can happen like explosions. Broken pipes can cause floods that can wreck all your stuff. All good to know, but if we need to turn off the water or electricity, how do we do it? We started off with a Toby hunt. <laughs> Found it! Now sometimes the Toby is covered by dirt and bushes. So, yep, just open it here. You find the tap inside and you can turn it clockwise until it's all the way off. Now, it might only need a gentle turn, so take care. But, but if it hasn't been turned for a while, then you might need a tool like this to actually shift it. If you can smell gas inside the house after a quake, immediately get out of the house and stay out. Turn the gas off at the meter, but only do that if you can smell gas or if you've been told to turn it off by the authorities. If you do smell gas, don't touch any electrical switches on your way out of the house. If gas isn't an issue and you spot sparks, broken wires or other electrical damage, best to turn off the power as long as you can do so safely. So now we know where the Toby is. And we'll never forget it. <laughs>